Motorola G4 with Marshmallow and Nougat review, and this is StuTech. There you go, so this is the Motorola G4 with Marshmallow and Nougat version. So as you can see, they look absolutely the same as far as the home screen is concerned. The time is absolutely the, sta the same as well, the display and thing like that. So I'm just gonna uh, show you like the beaten pieces uh, on what are the difference between the two, all right? So this is the Motorola G4. These are uh, these videos are absolutely the same anyway. It's just one mobile phone Okay, so I'm just gonna um, turn it off for you so we can see which one is the, the, the you know the quick or quickest one in terms of booting up So let's just wait for that. There you go So I'm just gonna count and one two go Okay So let's just wait for that and as you can see Nougat and Marshmallow are really different um, in terms of welcome logo now so it is now pretty good in Nougat so I would say yeah I like the Nougat way so these Motorola G4 anyway made by Lenovo as well so it's kind of like a partnership so Motorola G4 there you go so I'm just gonna see that and Lenovo they got so 35 seconds on the Motorola Marshmallow and 35 seconds and um, yeah a little bit with Nougat so I would say the Marshmallow is still a little bit quicker than the Nougat in terms of booting up so there you go so yeah so these are the lock screen at the moment so i actually updated the mobile phone after um one hour so as you can see there is a time difference between the two so and in terms of the widget there is still the circular widget time clock so that's that one that you can still you know manipulate so same thing you can still do the same yeah and these are the home um, home screen, I mean all the applications, so still color white background, so yeah Still white background. So if we see the, the drop down, there you go They are absolutely the same. One thing is missing is the cast on that um, But you can still add it, you know in the future if you want to so yeah, same thing So the icons on top moved a little bit, but yeah, it's all right in terms of the camera. There you go It's still it's still um absolutely the same there is no changes or anything like that so that's still the camera logo there um yeah when you press this button you still have all the options and thing like that um yeah you have the panorama video and special video thing that you can use yeah and of course you have the um if you want to take photographs manually settings so you can still do that thing yeah so just keep an eye on this one take a look that's still the same okay there you go all right so in terms of closing it um they are still absolutely the same there's no gut in the uh, marshmallow so you can still swipe it to the left um, yeah to the right sorry yeah for you to close the application so yeah so the messaging itself still the same icons are the same messaging are the same um, of course you can't change it still the same yeah mm. in terms of the telephones or phone keypad still you know keyboard still the same yeah, and if we go to settings as well, um, there are some changes on there. As you can see, um, there are like a specific name on the Nougat now. It will tell you 0%, 48 app installed and thing like that. So that is just additional. Yeah, but there is one thing I want about this one. One gigabyte on a memory use with Marshmallow 832 with Nougat. So all the application are closed, but I don't know why. And then the 
the size of the OS or operating system still 5 gigabytes, uh, 5.06 gigabytes. So um, fairly all right. So it didn't change or oh, didn't change anything and something like that. Whereas in terms of shortcut, this is what I like about the Motorola G4 as well, is the double tap of the lock button, it will turn the camera on. So it's still, um, both mobile phones still have that. And one thing is the shaking your mobile phone to open the camera application. So it's still working on both devices. So um, no problem about that. They didn't get rid of it because I really like it. Okay, but aside from that, everything is absolutely the same. Um, a logo um, has changed for the um, welcome logo. But aside from that, that's it. There you go. So that's the Motorola G4 after showing you the difference between the, the um, Marshmallow and the Nougat. So you can actually say whatever you want to say, but for me, it didn't have any changes or anything like that. They're kind of the same. There are some mild changes, but not too much, I would say. So it is something to do with um, just saying, oh, it's a Nougat, but however, there is no difference at all. So yeah. And another thing, um, yeah, um, you know, all the icons are still pretty boring, um, the camera settings still the same, and yeah, no, um, I would say it might be worth it, um, updating it, so just to say you have no guts on your Motor Motorola G4, however, it's not that really interesting but anyhow so well hopefully you enjoyed the video and if you have any question about this Motorola G4 um, you can actually just comment down in the comment section below and don't forget to subscribe anyway and you can actually check out all the videos in my um, YouTube channel so I have all sort of thing in there so all Android and thing and Samsung and test or camera test or wood test all right so yeah and uh, don't forget to share this video as well if you like. Okay, so goodbye for now and see you again. Bye-bye.